Hi everyone. For today's story time, I'm going to be reading The Magic Bubbles, written by me, Isabel Otter, and illustrated by Fung Gwen Quang and Huyn Kim Lin. Oliver loves blowing bubbles. As they float up, up and away, the whole world glitters with promise. Bubbles sparkle, bubble shimmer, bubble twinkle, bubble glimmer. He knows that his bubbles are magic. When Oliver waves his bubble wand, the dull grey street where he lives is transformed. Birds sing and people smile or stop to chat. No one is rushing or frowning. The street feels joyful. The beautiful bubbles bring people together. Bubble wiggle, bubble waggle, bubble bop, bubble hop. Do the bubble dance. Oliver's favourite place is under a tree on top of a hill. He feels free and peaceful here. Bubble breathe, bubble drift, bubble float, bubble lift. As the bubbles fly away, Oliver sails with them. The bubbles take Oliver on magical journeys to faraway places. Bubble dive, bubble splash, bubble swim, bubble flash. Bubble whoosh, bubble far, bubble fly, bubble star. Bubble strum, bubble sing, bubble dream, bubble swing. All of a sudden, pop! These children don't believe in magic. Just like that, the dreams are gone. The next day, when Oliver blows his bubbles, the street remains dull and grey. Nobody smiles or stops to chat. People are rushing and frowning. The street feels sad. Mum asks Oliver what's wrong. My bubbles aren't really magic. It was make-believe all along, he explains sadly. I'm going to tell you a secret, says Mum. The magic doesn't come from your bubbles. It comes from you. But the magic only works if you believe in it. Oliver thinks about Mum's words. He just isn't quite sure. But then he remembers. Bubble smile, bubble dance, bubble talk, bubble prance. His bubbles brought people together. Perhaps the magic really does come from Oliver after all. What do you think? <laughs>